This is firstcoast.tv. There's a wonderful play that's going to open um, very soon. We'll get more details about it very soon. Uh, I'm here with Lee Weaver. Okay, as all of you who might know him, Lee Weaver is a playwright and an actor. Um, he um, acts all around the country, but here in St. Augustine, we know him quite well. He's put out some some works that have been very, very interesting and stir a lot of conversation. So this new work is called what? It's called The Shooter with a subtitle, Gun Violence in America. Mm. And um, in this drama, it takes about two hours with the intermission, uh, my wife Nanette uh, plays Joan, a director uh, television impresario, if you will, and she makes uh, uh, documentaries with her husband, Bill, who keeps things moving backstage. And uh, in The Shooter, she interviews uh, nine persons, all of whom have had their lives uh, tragically affected by gun violence. Okay, all right. Uh, now, what other plays have you done in town? Well. I've got uh, uh, about a dozen shows that I do, and I won't mention all of them, but uh, the, this, uh, the shooter is part of what I call the four-part redemption series. The first uh, three or four years ago it was called The Secret about religious intolerance, and um, actually the Spanish Inquisition here in St. Augustine in the um, uh, 16th century. And then after that was uh, The Box, which was about a homeless Vietnam War veteran with PTSD who sleeps in a box here in St. Augustine. And then a year or so ago, Nanette and I uh, produced The Witness, which was about the civil rights struggle in the 1960s and particularly about uh, what took place here in St. Augustine. And in that I play former self-confessed racist who tells of all the thuggery in which he was engaged. Now this, the uh, the shooter, is the fourth and perhaps the final part of the Redemption series. Okay. Now the play will be playing where and when? It's a week from tonight, which is the 22nd, that means the 29th, uh, next week on Thursday, at the Corazon Theatre. Uh, in town near the Leitner Museum and um, it's, uh, it's a lovely place to perform. We're going to be crowded. I'm, I'm pleased the ticket sales are already uh, where they are. Out. They're I, sold out. I think we have two seats left. Okay. Yes. All right. And um, for those who don't get a chance to see it this time, we're probably, uh, you, I guess you plan to do it again. Yes, I scheduled it just for one night in case it was a turkey and needing more work, but I'm feeling pretty good about it. It's, uh, I think I'll be doing it in early December at the Pioneer Barn at their uh, lovely theater there on, a, on San Marco. And uh, I, I plan on doing several more nights of it. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, I thank you very much, and I hope everyone uh, who can get those two seats, go get them, <laughs> and, and we'll stay tuned to see uh, we carry you in our calendar. First Coast.tv has a calendar. And if you do put it up again, we will definitely carry it on our calendar. And we thank you very much, Mr. Lee Weaver. I thank you, Jorge Rivera, without whom this town wouldn't know what's happening. <laughs> uh, you're, you're a treasure in our community. I thank, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Have a lovely day, my friend.